Hello, I'm Fiona Walsh from Imagine Coaching and today we're going to look at icons. To insert an icon, click on the Insert tab and then click on the Icons button. There's a whole load of different icons that we can choose here. I'm going to choose this one because this works well for my demonstration and insert. So I'm going to make the icon a little bit bigger and show you what you can do with it. So when we click on the icon, the graphic tools tab format tab will open and right over to the far left here, we have convert to shape. So we're going to convert to shape. And now what we have is each of these um, circles is a unique shape and the same with the arrow. So what I can do is I can click on the arrow. I can drag that out and I can edit just this part. So for example, I'm now going to click back on the drawing tools format bar here and I want to change the color. So I'm going to change that to red. What I can also do with this one is I can edit the shape of this arrow. So when I'm clicked on the shape in my drawing tools format tab, Right over to the left again, we have Edit Shape here. And there's a drop down, and under that, we've got Edit Points. So now what I can do is I can try and change that shape into a pointed arrow. So each of these black items here can be dragged to make a uh, edit the shape. So now I have a pointed arrow, and so I might want to put that back in rather than having the circle, I'll leave it back out. Okay, and if we wanted to move this around, we can highlight the other items. So highlight the two circles and the arrow, and then we can group that to uh, change the shape or move it around. Okay, if you like that, connect with me on LinkedIn to see more. Thanks, bye.